Hey everyone out there in YouTubesville, and I uh, hate anyone else who's not on YouTube, but I guess, how would you be watching this if it wasn't on YouTube? Huh? Yeah. Anyways, I got a black and white battle for you today. The name's Ian, and this is against my boy Doodlebob, and he's definitely packing a standard team. He's got the OU staples on lockdown, rocking the toad too, so you know there's going to be weather involved, and I'm kind of using this. UUE standardy hybridy mix matchy team so it's gonna be fun notice some big weaknesses in my team namely ice and dark so in future battles you'll probably see me revamping this team a whole lot but anyways it's a really cool battle uh, we both make some really good plays he is like on top of his game this doodle bob fella so he's out predicting me most of the way but I get a couple good jabs in there so I hope you enjoy cause it's battle time battle time BAM and yeah so here we go he's gonna start with iRain the Apple product version of the Politoed and he's gonna make it drizzle and I'm gonna lead with my choice spec Starmie gonna go right for the Thunderbolt because I thought maybe at this range it'd be, take, be able to take it out I get the power hack so I'm like woo but then he uses the hidden power grass or electric, and he gets a grid. So, hacks for hacks, an eye for an eye. Gets rid of my Starmie, and I'm going to see you turn right here with my choice banded Azel, and I'm going to be able to take him out. Now, I thought from this battle that taking out his weather guy should be my top priority, but really, when you don't have weather of your own, that's not really a big deal. Like, honestly, you shouldn't even try to take it out because. He's just going to want a death water anyway. He has no use for his weather guy if I have no weather to counter with. So, boo. Anyways, he's going to go into Slowbro, Ice Beam my Drift Blim, and I'm going to rest so I can get the Unburdened Chesto Resto style recovery. And I'm going to set up a Calm Mine here, knowing that because his nickname is Flinch, he's probably going to be a special variety, and he just nicknamed him that to trick me. And I was right. Unfortunately for me, Shadow Ball's just not going to do very much, and his Thunder's going to still do a shit ton, so... Yeah, my detective work really was in vain. And he's going to keep thundering me down, and I'm just going to want to rest up again, knowing I can get a speedy rest off, and I'm going to just try to switch out Paper Blimp, you know, at like a, uh, a modest half health. Even though really, it's not going to do me much good anyway. Paper Blimp's pretty much dead at this point. So I'm going to recall my Paper Blimp, go into my Bigger On, anticipating another Thunder, but he reads me like a book, goes right for the Stealth Rocks, great play on his part, and he's going to withdraw right here, anticipating the Earthquake. I'm playing predictably, and I go right for it, and uh, his Bromance is uh, ripping me apart. I'm going to go for the Rapid Spin, though. I want to just get those out of the way, but he's going to go for the Ice Beam. Really? I didn't really know what to do here. I have really no good switches, switch-ins for anything he's packing, so I just set up rocks on my own, kind of leave bigger on for fodder, just kind of trying to get the free switch into something, to something. What can stop this slow, bro? So I give Booyah a try. He switches out, goes into his scissors, and uh, I'm going to go for the trick right here, hoping to get one of his walls, but nope. He's, he's making amazing plays. He goes into the Choice Band Scissor, knowing Mabuya's Choice Banded, and now he's gonna Pursuit Lock me in and just kill Mabuya, so BOO! Yeah? Come on. But, going to Egg Salad right here, figuring Egg Salad is a pretty good wall for this guy, because he's just gonna use Pursuit, which is super effective, mind you, but this is my defensive Egg Salad, my defensive Executor, and so I'm gonna get a, uh, a citrus berry substitute and it's gonna keep me up at half and he's gonna keep pursuing but I'm gonna get the leech seed off so eventually it's not gonna be advantageous for him to stay in and yeah I harvest another berry this sets really cool I have never used an executor with the harvest but I love it in uh, in other battles where I've used it he's gotten harvest like every single turn and I can just keep subbing it just keeps him alive so well it's his survivability is off the roof. And, uh, but he's just gonna go into his slow bro right here. He's able to break my sub with ease. 
but look at that, I get the harvest back and a leech seed up, so I'm looking pretty. I think I'm faster than you, slow bro, I think. I mean, maybe, maybe I'm not. But look at that, look at that citrus berry. And Exiled's just as happy as a clam. And I'm gonna get some leech seed back. This is a really stally part of the battle. I just kind of wanted to break it up though. Going to the top, toppy slim here, as he's gonna keep ice beaming. I try to keep it fresh for you guys. I'm gonna be real. Anyways, he's gonna get that regenerator boost switch back out in a flinch, his specially attacking guy. And I'm gonna kind of make a good prediction. I go right for the close combat. And he's gonna go for a thunder right here. And poops for me, because he's packing the para hacks with this thunder, so that's gonna rain on my parade. But I'm gonna go for another close combat after living that. Because, you know, Toby Slim's a defensive mo-fo. He can take a punch. And he can deliver him. And you know, I wasn't really that concerned because I got the priority. This Toby Slim's all priority. And even with the para hacks, I'm able to surprise him with the sucker punch, take out his Latios. So, booyah. Kinda, kinda make a, a comeback. Make this battle not as humiliating of a defeat. But... Now when he's got this, he's rocking the scissor with the choice pan, I'm gonna go into Egg Salad, who does not take that bullet punch well at all, so... It's looking bad for me. I get a leech seed off, though. Gonna protect, stall him. Just try to... try to do something. But really, at this point in the game, it is good game, compadre. And, uh... I'm gonna go into Paper Blimp right here. Just trying to switch things up. And Paper Blimp's gonna basically die to a bullet punch as well as Executor. I'm just drawing it out, because I'm a loser. Anyways, great battle, Doodle Bob. Love rocking the Executor. Gonna definitely revamp this team. Maybe we can have a rematch or something. I don't know. If you guys like this, though, you can rate, comment, like, subscribe it. I'd appreciate it. And, uh, have a great day. Peace out, Trout.